Hey everybody, uh, it's Eric back in the beer yard. I'm um, going to do a couple things today. One, I'm going to be looking at the uh, queens that I grafted the other day. I only had about three out of, I think, nine uh, take, so um, not too good. And we're also in a dearth right now in Alabama, so I'm having to really feed my bees. Um, I made a three-way uh, mating nuke. Uh, I'm going to show that to you. And uh, we're about to take... The queen cells that we had grafted about five or six days ago that's in this hive right here. And we're going to put them under this queen castle that I made, a three-way mating nuke. You'll see that it has on the back side an entrance for the center little colony. And on the front side, we've got two entrances for the other two. Now this bottom down here, there's there's no i've got a solid bottom underneath there so bees cannot get into either one of those hives i just used another bottom board that i had okay we'll be uh, pulling the queen cells again from this colony right here they're in the top there's uh three queen cells i'm going to actually only use two because that little guy way down there that one right there does not have a queen so I'm going to requeen that guy. And I'll be pulling resources from probably each one of them to be able to make um, the three-way mating nukes for the virgin queens for this guy right here. Now, according to the fat bee man, all you need is a couple of baby bees and a queen. Or a queen cell, rather. And you can make a hive. So I'm hoping that this will work. I've seen a lot of people have success with these. And um, just kind of show you what it's in it. Okay, just kind of give you an idea of what we're looking at. Three boards, got an inner uh, separation board. Each one of these is made out of old whiteboard that you use for teaching. I had some old stuff like that that I used with the kids. I just got some frames in here now. I'll be pulling frames from the other hives. So, anyway, three of these, and I'll be feeding with sugar water out of a glass jar. Okay, first things first. Got to make sure my queens are doing okay, or queen cells, rather. It's not the best starter finisher at all, but it's all I've got, guys. Remember, my goal is to try to get 20 hives this year, but I don't think I'm going to make it. Hopefully, I can get to at least nine before we get into the winter. got three queen cells uh, one is not capped that's okay I'll take that guy and put him in the other hive and these two will go into the mating nuke so this actually worked out good so they must have just been capped like today I'll leave these in here cap brood already yep on both sides so this will be good look at this guy right here not really a whole lot of anything just a little bit of storage i'm gonna put this down in the bottom We got 
some stores here, so yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna put this over here. And I'm gonna put a queen cell right in the middle of them. One of these already pulled out, guys. Gotta be real careful. I'm looking. So that's that one. Do another one here, but I'm gonna go in different location to get brewed. And I'm I think we're in kind of a dearth here in Alabama because my bees are kind of. Check it out. Queen is bringing it all the way to the edges. There is larva all the way at the edge out here. That's really good. I just want to be able to make sure that we've got the queen in here. see eggs and I see eggs so I'm good yeah she's she's producing well there she is too found her she's a red queen right there we're good I don't know if you saw it or not Gonna go to the other side. Right here. Alright, we will take those stores. And we will, we will take the stores and we will put a queen cell number two right here. Not very big queens, but we'll give it a shot. They're not very big queen cells. Hopefully, they'll do fine. sure why I got stung but got stung right here so I gotta scrape the bar ball Alright, that's all I'm going to do with that one. And I'm going to use the other queen into the small box over there. So I'm going to do that now.
think that's probably going to be the best. Okay. Let's see if they'll accept her. They should. They don't have a queen. They should do everything they can to help her. I'm tempted to give them a pollen patty, though. Who is a high beetle? I may give this... I may give this guy, this box, a pollen patty to help rear her. But she's almost capped, so I think we're good. Okay, so I've got it set up. I went ahead and put another shake of bees in this number one. As you can see, I went ahead and put sugar water on top. We got this extra um, deep. All right, that is my three-way mating nuke, and uh, hopefully we'll be able to have a couple more queens out of here, and we'll have a queen out of the uh, the one that's uh, queenless right now.